also been a busy week for our search and rescue crews over in Red River Gorge. Wolf County rescue officials alone posted about two separate incidents just in the last few days. WKYT's Julia Sandor joining us now in studio to tell us more about some of these recent incidents they've been dealing with. That's right, Kelsey. This year alone, Wolf County Search and Rescue officials tell me they've had about 35 rescue missions. Two of those, like you said, were just this week. But people are still hitting the trails and exploring the gorge, and officials say it's important to take the right precautions. We've been averaging uh, somewhere in the 80s um, number of missions that we run each year. That's certainly ticked up over the past four or five years. Wolf County Search and Rescue Chief John May is an experienced hiker, going through these trails numerous times, seeing the steep hills and tricky terrain. He says before setting out on your hike, let someone know where you are and where you're headed. I do that and I'm a very experienced hiker. I'll always call my wife and say, hey, you know, I'm on Rock Bridge Trail. Uh, I should be out by three. If you haven't heard from me by four, it's time to call someone. On Friday, a 46-year-old Lexington woman was injured on a rugged trail. Fortunately, the search and rescue team found the group. Just because of the sheer volume, I mean, we average one and a half a week, and most of them take hours. Uh, you know, the one last night, uh, we started around 6 and finished about 10.30. And just one day before that rescue, their moving water rescue and dive team were dispatched to a drowning incident on Wolf Lake. Water temperatures are still fairly cool, you know, which can set in cramps if you're trying to swim like that. Uh, you know, we encourage people as boating season and swimming season starts to ramp up. You know, if you're on a lake, uh, especially if you're not a very good swimmer, have some type of flotation device with you and never try to cross a large body of water without something. Wolf County is full of beautiful scenery, but preparing to see it ahead of time could save people from dangerous situations. It's a great spot to visit. Just do it safely. And Kelsey, Chief May tells me that some of those trails are really difficult, so it's important to know your own skill level. Obviously, the weather plays a factor in that as well, and, you know, they're all volunteers, so we do appreciate exactly. their yeah. work and sacrifice. I know they work with other groups and agencies as well to get all that done, so we appreciate yeah, that. Yeah, definitely. They were out there today, and they'll be out there, you know, for the rest of the weekend as well. Thank you so much, Julia.